Many years ago when I went to high school, I remember that my interest in guitar and maybe music in general was going downhill. All the people that I played in the band with, they moved away and I was getting more into school things and skateboarding, so I didn't play that much guitar. But then I discovered Queens of the Stone Age and as many of you know, I'm a big fan or at least I used to be a big fan. They have always been a big part of my guitar and music interest. But anyway, the band sparked a whole new interest in guitar for me. And this was also around when I got a good internet connection. And I was starting to research a lot about guitars and different guitars. And I was never that into strats and Les Pauls. I always was kind of looking for something different and with Josh Hami and Queens of the Stone Age, I discovered many cool and new guitar bands. So back in that Songs for the Deaf era, Josh was using his Ovation GP Ultra. That guitar was only built in 84. It was discontinued the same year and it wasn't really that popular at all. It has been made more popular now because of Josh, who is not using them anymore. But um, so yeah, they are really difficult to find. Back then I could not find them at all, especially here in Norway. And now I'm doing a new how to sound like. I have done Queens of the Stone Age already, one of the most popular videos here on my channel, but I'm doing Caius. So I thought, hey, I really want to have a GP Ultra in that video. But they are impossible to find and if you find them they are really expensive so I talked to Eastwood who has made a replica kind of of the GP Ultra and now it's here. So here it is, the Eastwood GP. It looks identical to the GP Ultra by Ovation, uh, except the headstock, which is different. That is okay though. I think it's really cool that they sent the black one, uh, since that's the one that Josh used in the Caius era. I haven't really tried it that much yet, but it seems solid as a rock and it really seems like a high quality instrument. I'm going to put some thicker strings on this now to tune it down to C and we are going to see how it sounds as well.
that was a lot of fun. I'm super stoked on this guitar. It's basically everything that I wanted it to be. I never played a guitar that handles C tuning that well. So I'm guessing that's the reason why Josh Homme got one in the first place. Stay tuned for my How to Sound Like Caius and also let me know if you want a part two kind of redo of the uh, How to Sound Like Queens of the Stone Age with this guitar. Let me know in the comments. All right, that's it for now. Thanks a lot to Eastwood for sending this guitar over. I'm super stoked on it and thanks a lot. Okay, stay tuned. Bye everyone.